Party people, it is Monday. I am back at the theater. I didn't post a vlog Saturday, so I only picked up the camera three times on Friday and I worked Friday morning and then I went immediately to the hospital. Well, my grandma picked me up, she had some running around to do, and then we went to the hospital. And then I was there until Dungeons and Dragons, and then it was Dungeons and Dragons, and then it was so late at night, and I had to work on Saturday, and I was exhausted so. I'll put some the clips, parts of the clips, something about the clips from Friday in now, I guess. And um, then just get on with our regularly programmed day. Good morning, super cool party people. It is Friday and I am back at work. I think I work for the next five days in a row if I'm lucky, six if I'm unlucky. And um, yeah. My body is really hurting, not like really hurting, but it's hurting a fair amount from yesterday because I was pushing my grandma around in a wheelchair a lot and like carrying things, so yeah, it's a little rough, but we will survive. I think today's gonna be a pretty short day, which will be nice, and then I can probably go visit my grandpa in the hospital before Dungeons and Dragons, you know, just so he's not bored. And um yeah, so I think that's the plan for today and also hopefully getting some more editing done. I still, I know like it's the last day of the month so technically I'm still on May's goals and May's goals did not include my third revision so I could technically not do any but I really like that I'm getting stuff done and I want to keep on this train while I can. But yeah, so I think I'm gonna go get to work. My hair is just... I don't understand how big it is. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna get to work have my breakfast drink first and then I'll check in with you along the way and hopefully it won't all take place after like seven o'clock like it did yesterday but you know extenuating circumstances so I'll see you later okay so I just got home it is 4:30. Uh, I've been at the hospital since I got off work well, I was running around with my grandma first helping her get stuff done and then at the hospital hanging out with my grandpa getting his cell phone set up so it had contacts so he could call people he just called me I was like oh no what happened but he's just making sure he remembered how to use the phone so that's good and now it's time for D&D so I'll see you after but also it's so hot I am like sweating but yeah I will see you after D&D now hopefully less sweaty and gross. Okay, well it is 11 o'clock, just finished D&D. &D. I am gassed, I'm about to pass out, so I'm not gonna edit this vlog. I don't know if this fidget will ever go up. Uh, good night. <laughs> yeah, so that's all I got from Friday, so yeah. But um, today is Monday, I said that already. Saturday and Sunday I worked both days. They were split shifts, so I had to come in in the morning and then I get in the afternoon. And so in between I went to lunch and then I went to a coffee shop and I got some writing done so that's exciting except I've now hit the two chapters that I need to basically completely write and so that kind of halted me in my tracks last night because I don't want to skip them this time I already skipped a part where I put that I want to put in another chapter but I'm not 100% sure so we're leaving that for now just because I'm not sure but these are two chapters that I know I want to put in so that's fun but I think I got like 7,000 words done on the weekend, which isn't bad considering how tired I was and how tired I am. It's, it, I'm exhausted, but we're surviving, so, well, debatable. Uh, today I have to work and then we have a staff meeting and if you've been around at the, the first Monday of any month, you know that I hate, oh there goes the hood, you know that I hate staff meetings on days that I work because it disrupts my day, it makes my day go longer. As much of a pain as it is to come in on a day when I don't work just for like a quick two hour meeting, I would rather that 100%, but that's fine. So I should be here until mid-afternoon, I would guess, based on that. And then my grandparents are back in town from their crazy adventures away. I think they're here for like one night, we're going to dinner tonight everybody and then I think they're leaving tomorrow so it's gonna be a busy day plus my grandpa's brother at least one of them is in town to visit him today so yeah there's a lot happening today and I really just want to go to sleep but I can't so I'm gonna go have my breakfast drink in hopes that that somehow wakes me up and then I'm gonna 
get to work. That's the word. Whew. Well, hello. It has been a long time. This is terrible lighting. Oh well, what can you do? So, ah, uh, I got off work. It was a long day. I ended up meeting up with my grandma, went up to the hospital to visit my grandpa. His brother was there, so I guess that's my, my uncle? Great, great grand uncle? I don't know. Um, and then uh, my other grandparents showed up. <laughs> There's a lot of people there. And then they had to go to their storage unit, which if you remember from Christmas, I constantly got stuck in. And so we went there and I helped them sort through and put some more stuff in because they've been living in a motorhome for a couple months now. And so my grandma was like, if I haven't used it in five months, I'm probably not gonna use it. So she, they were offloading some of that stuff. And then I went with my other grandma, so the wife of my grandpa who was in the hospital, and she had to do some shopping, so I helped her with that. And then we went for dinner with a huge group of us, everybody in the family. And then I went with my grandma to get coffee to bring to my grandpa in the hospital. And he was sleeping, so I, and like, I just went up by myself. And I walked in, just me. I'm the only person like moving in the hospital with coffee. I bring it, he was sleeping, so I dropped it. And then I left, and I'm like, they're gonna think I like smothered a patient or something, but. Yeah, so anyways, he'll have coffee when he wakes up and I'm sure he'll appreciate that. Probably tomorrow morning he'll just reheat it, but that's fine. And now I'm home and I am le tired, but it's cool. I'm gonna like put on something nice and cozy. I mean, I'm mostly in sweats, but I think I just want something cozy on top. And um, I'm gonna go socialize upstairs. So I'll see you after, I think. I wanna try to get some editing done today, but I don't know how promising that looks but it's fine <laughs> alrighty so it is now the end of the day wait this is louder than normal and um yeah we played a couple games and then my grandparents and I stayed up and talked and they were telling me all about their adventures because they've been on the road since February pretty much so a couple months and they've done like a U down through the states and back up to Canada so that's pretty cool and they showed me a bunch of pictures and like told me these crazy stories about some of the places they've been, some museums, so that was neat. But it is now almost 11 and I'm sleepy and I need to edit this vlog and I haven't edited a vlog in days. So I'm gonna go to sleep and um, I'll see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. <laughs> Good night.